dance again are Susanna and her partner Kevin. <laughs> Now, it's been a series of two halves for this couple. Their Pasadobli in Blackpool brought the house down, topped the judges' scores, but last week's Argentine tango saw them at the bottom of the leaderboard. Here's what the judges think they need to do to make it through to the final. For me, Susanna Reid is what this show is all about. She's gone from reading the news to be in the news on the dance floor. No one expected her to have that kind of natural ability to connect, to play different parts. What I loved was her pasadoble. It was like a buffet of Spanish tapas, full of tasty morsels right the way through. She really came out and sold that number. She dominated. She was on top of the occasion. She is a bit of an all-round. I thought her waltz was beautiful. Susanna really does struggle with parts of Latin, for instance, her chal chal chal. It did not pop, it did not sing, it was all a little bit mumsy. Throughout the series, there's always some dances that don't really suit exactly. you. Yeah. It was the actual hip action that didn't have that kind of natural, easy flow to it. You know, sometimes they underdo it or sometimes they over push it. Well, it was the first one she didn't actually look comfortable in. The performances are always very endearing is the finish of the movement, especially if she has a very fast ballroom dance. I think she's close. We're talking little details, details here. Yeah, yeah. You know, to get kicked out in the semi-final, devastating. I'm a little concerned for Susanna. That was as a club dance, yeah. isn't it? You know, and she's got to come out with that atmosphere and really sizzle in. They really need to get this dance right. Otherwise, I'm afraid it's game over. I think the salsa is a tough dance to impress the judges with in the semi-finals. Obviously, lots of hip movement and quite complicated steps and some lifts. So it's quite a challenge doing it in the semi-final. It can be all very much here. We don't really want it to be here and presented. Mm. So actually, whereas we got criticised in samba for being a bit muddy, mm. that's actually quite good in salsa. Salsa is the difference between getting to the final or going home. So we have to bring everything we've got to the dance floor. Dancing the Salsa, Susanna Reed and Kevin Clifton. Won't stop, won't stop, won't stop the beat to go! Have you shaved your chest yet? I have. Oh, you have? Yeah. I always found a blowtorch was the best way to do it. <laughs> well, good. It looks great. It looks great. You, Len, what did you think well, of that? Full of energy. There was no holding back. It was all or nothing. The final or bust. And with all that intensity, all that attack, on occasion, Susanna, it got all tad messy here and there. Oh. But... Oh. It is what it is. Yeah. 
Bruno. I mean, I mean, I love it. You come out here, I can really see you want to make it to that final. And you work so hard. You throw everything you got into it. And you sell it beautifully. I'm with you with that. <laughs> but it is the semi-final. And Lenny is right. The movement, because you put so much into it, become a bit messy. You don't finish properly. We oh. told you before. Precision. Oh. We love the energy. Precision, precision, precision. These are the salsa girls I like dancing with, though. <laughs> oh, I bet your people will do so. <laughs> well, yeah. Craig, yeah, we've got Craig now. Darling, if I had a pound for every facial expression, <laughs> you would have that. darling, I'd be a multi-millionaire. I could be a rich man, Craig. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. A little bit heavy of foot for me, and the guy's right, messy. But, oh, um, really? Vivacious, darling, vivacious. Vivacious, well... Here we are. And Darcy, darling. Well, for me, you look so much more relaxed and natural in a Latin. And I haven't seen that. And that you gave us tonight, 100% disco energy. The boys are right. The leg action is fades in and out, comes in and out. But still, full on. Full on, you gave us the full And we all love you. Oh, we love you. I love dancing it. Oh, yeah, you, we could see you loved it. Off you go. <laughs> Shimmies, I love those shimmies. Now, I know that Latin hasn't been your favourite, but I've never seen you have so much fun on the dance floor. Did it feel good? It felt ridiculously, fantastically good fun. And it looked like it too. So, to, to add to a muddy samba, I can now say I've done a messy salsa. Uh -oh. <laughs> Let's go down to messy samba. Now, all the judges agreed that you threw everything into that. What would it mean to get through to the final? It would be absolutely phenomenal. I mean, it really would. We, I mean, you know, I just adore dancing with Kevin, and it's a total privilege and an honour. And it's it, not a dance on my ears. No, it has yes. been incredible to be able to tonight dance not just once, but twice with you. Twice. So thank you very much. And he shaved the chest. Oh, oh, oh there it is. Hey, show. Want to... My children. Well, my children. children, have you played scores? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> the judges have their scores. Craig Revel Hallwood. Eight. <laughs> Darcy Bustle. Eight. Lynn Goodman. Eight. Bruno Tonioli. Eight. Eight. Okay. That's all right. Well, you're best you That's all right. This is another one. Judges saw, but what about you? Did Susanna's salsa get you shimming on the sofa? Call 622-5203 from your mobile. 09015-2252-03 from your landline. Or vote online. That vote is going to open very soon indeed. We've got just one couple left to take to the floor and dance for their place in the grand final. Ladies and gents, are you ready for it?